For the past few years, we have seen so many anti-voter laws that there is a danger of becoming accustomed to these laws. I will not yield. I will not flinch. I will defend the right to vote, our democracy against all enemies, foreign and, yes, domestic. All right, that was President Joe Biden there and Vice President Kamala Harris. They traveled to Georgia yesterday urging Congress to pass a voting rights bill that would make permanent many of the temporary measures that were put into place before the 2020 election as the pandemic raged. The president also formally endorsed changing the filibuster for the first time in his 50 years of public life. Don't forget, he was first elected to the Senate way back in 1972. Joining us now for more is former Republican senator from Georgia, Kelly Leffler. Uh, senator, great to have you on the show. Thanks, Rob. It's great to be with y'all. Yeah, nice to see you again. Um, I just wanted to get your top line reaction to Stacey Abrams not showing up yesterday. She's someone who claims to be a champion of voting rights, certainly in the state of Georgia. She chose not to appear with Joe Biden and Kamala Harris in her home state, in her hometown, a state, by the way, where she's running for governor again. Well, and voting rights is allegedly her core issue. But you know, with her appointment yesterday, she was a no-show here uh, with, with the Biden roadshow, and she just didn't want to lend him any of her political capital. I mean, Biden's down, he's underwater, 29 points here in Georgia. Right. Um, but, you know, moreover, most importantly, if you think about the people of Georgia, this roadshow from Washington was really an insult. I mean, he came to talk about something that's not a real issue here. And, you know, Georgians, when you're out talking to everyday Georgians, we're concerned about inflation, open borders, closed schools, and to have Washington come into Georgia, which is about as far policy-wise as you can get from Washington, it was just really insulting and didn't even make the, the top of the fold on the front page of the AJC Digital Virgin this morning. So, you know, we're ready to move on from Isn't that. Isn't that interesting? Hey, I'm Rob Finnerty. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please join the conversation in the comments below. Don't forget to subscribe too. Hit the bell icon to be alerted to breaking news. And remember, there's a whole lot more on Newsmax TV, America's fastest growing cable news network. Newsmax TV, where real news for real people.